Meat is ground together with spices and herbs. It's then packed into an oven-proof dish. It's sprinkled with pine nuts and tomato slices are added together with salt and pepper, some pomegranate molasses, fried potatoes, and onion that's been tossed in sumac. It's baked and enjoyed. Welcome back to Cravings Food Adventures. As you know, I love Arabic food. Today we're going to be making a kefta bake. This is basically kefta mince and it's going to be baked in my oven. It's going to be super delicious. Before I go any further with this recipe, to be sure to subscribe to my channel and make sure to ring that bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Now, let's get cooking. To make the ground meat mixture, I'm going to start with one cup of parsley leaves. I'm going to add this to my food processor, give it a quick process and remove. Now I'm going to add half a white onion, this is roughly one cup. Six cloves of garlic. I'm going to process this and then I'm going to add two pounds of ground lean beef. I'm also going to add a bunch of spices. I have one tablespoon of smoked paprika. One tablespoon of Aleppo peppers or you could just use Arabic chili powder. One tablespoon of cumin powder. One tablespoon of coriander powder and half a tablespoon of pepper. Add salt to taste. Add the parsley back in and start the processor. I'm going to shallow fry two cups of sliced potatoes or as many as you will need to cover your final dish. I have a rectangular baking dish here and I'm going to drizzle it with some olive oil and I'm going to spread it. Add the meat mixture and spread this out in a thin layer. I'm going to sprinkle this now with half a cup of pine nuts. Cover this with about 15 slices of tomatoes or as many as you will need to cover the surface. Sprinkle this with some salt and pepper. Some pomegranate molasses. Now I'm going to add the fried potatoes that I fried earlier and I'm going to add this in a layer as well. I have a cup of onion here and I'm just going to toss this together with half a teaspoon of sumac and I'm going to mix it. Add this onion over the top. Now I'm going to bake it in my 350 degree oven for 30 to 40 minutes till the meat has cooked down and then I'm going to serve it and enjoy. Thank you so much for joining me in Cravings Food Adventures. I hope you enjoyed this delicious recipe for kefta bake. It's a really easy recipe and it's a great thing to put together uh, for a weekday meal and it's super simple. If you love my videos, give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well as ring the bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. And be sure to follow me behind the scenes on all of my social channels. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter and TikTok. Until I see you next time, do take care. Happy eating. Bye.